On African soil, territories mean everything. No other animal knows the importance of owning one more than the lions. Occupy a territory and you own the animals that trespass on it. Their lives at the lion's mercy. Defend the territory and the pride can rest in peace. But let your guard down and all could be lost in the blink of an eye. On African soil, a lion knows that his life depends on the territory. I just, I just the king's pride. For millennia, lions have carved their territories on Africa's vast and ancient ground. Through time, the pressures of the modern world shrunk these wild expanses to isolated wilderness areas. The last frontiers of true Africa. In South Africa, Kruger is the largest. And on Kruger's western flank, an old male lion owns a prime piece of land in an area called the Timbavati. His family is the Shubeni pride. He's got it all figured out. And five cubs. He leaves his pride most nights to patrol his 150 square kilometer territory. It takes dedication to make sure no enemy crosses the boundaries. But some nights, he gets distracted. Muffled sounds give away that a warthog is in its den. The old lion digs to make the hole bigger and tries to get within biting distance of the animal. Determined to get to the warthog, he digs into the night. But his old muscles are not what they used to be. After a few hours, he gives up. He leaves the morning shift to the pride. While one of the lionesses and the older cubs dig, the youngest one keeps herself busy. She's almost six months old and still supplements her diet with her mother's milk. For the rest of the pride, it's a waiting game listening for the slightest sound, digging to enlarge the hole, waiting. The youngest cub takes the best seat. Within minutes, the boar is torn apart. Seven lions fight for their share. The two lionesses bully the cubs and take the largest pieces. The little one tries to grab what she can, but her mother is not sharing. When it comes to feeding, there is no love between lions. The young cub learns this quickly. The 40-kilogram warthog is too small to be a proper meal. 
Each lion grabs what it can get. In less than an hour, the kill is devoured. All that the youngest cub managed to grab is a bone. The old male is now 13 years old. He's held onto this great piece of Timbavati for almost nine years. In lion terms, this is unheard of. A tenure usually lasts no more than five or six years. He has been a strong leader for the Shabili pride. But times are changing. A few months ago, three lionesses left him and the pride. After roaming the expanses of Kruger, three brothers moved into the Timbavati and found an unattended piece of land south of Shabili territory. They have not crossed the invisible line into the old lion's turf. Not yet. The brothers are four years old. They are strong and confident. Every week, they kill the buffalo.